craving for street style spicy food this recipe is a perfect cure hey you magical people welcome to salty sugar saga and today we are making cheesy masala pav so without wasting any further time let's get started for this recipe first we need to dice our onion Now I'm gonna roughly chop my tomatoes because I'm gonna make a puree of that. So just roughly chop them. Don't forget to remove the eyes. So here I have my onions, tomato puree, and some corn kernels. I'm using the frozen one. You can always use the fresh ones. Now I'm chopping my bell pepper. You can use any color bell pepper or even the capsicum works great for this recipe. Now I have a Franky masala. If you don't know how to make it or you want to make it at home, you can see in the description box there's a link. You can click in the link and that will take you directly to the recipe. Now, uh, in a pan, add some oil, and the heat is around uh, medium to high heat. I'm gonna sauté my onions until they are nice golden brown. At this point, I'm gonna add my tomato puree, followed by ginger garlic paste. Now we're gonna add our salt. Cover it and let it cook for two minutes. Now we're gonna add tomato paste. अगर आपके पास tomato paste नहीं है, आप tomato puree use कर सकते हो, या फिर आप एक extra tomato add कर सकते हो. Tomato paste basically आपको बहुत अच्छा color देगा and it will give you more tanginess in the masala. See, immediately we have got the right, uh, nice red color in the masala. We cooked it for a couple of minutes. Now we're gonna add our veggies in that. So firstly, I'm gonna add the bell peppers and some corn kernels. I told you before as well. I'm using the frozen ones. If you're using fresh ones, it's important to boil them first and then use it. Now we'll saute them until it releases oil. Before that, let's season it with red chili powder, turmeric, and Franky masala. If you don't know the recipe of Franky masala, uh, pata hai, to aap description box mein ja sakte hai. There's a link. You can click on the link and that will take you directly to the recipe of Franky Masala. Now we're gonna add just half teaspoon of butter. Agar aap chahate ho, you can add more butter or agar aap chahate ho, to you can add less butter depending on your taste. Now it has released the oil, it's done. We're gonna just add the freshness of cilantro or coriander leaves and it's all set. Now 
uh, we have some buns here which I'm gonna half them This recipe makes 6 to 8 buns depending on how much masala you are using in each bun. Okay, so now I'm gonna put a good spoonful of masala on the bun. Top it with a mozzarella cheese. I'm using around half a teaspoon on each bun. It depends completely on your choice. If you want, you can use less, or if you want, you can use more. Now, in the same pan, um, I'm gonna place all my buns. We're gonna gently toast them in the butter so that we get all the street style flavor. This is the advantage of making the street style food at home that you can use a ingredient the way you want. If you want more butter, you can add more butter. If you want less cheese in butter, you can add less cheese in butter. We're gonna gently press them and toast them from both the sides. So our buns, our pows are almost done. We're gonna plate them. Guys, you can see a logo of Salt and Sugar Saga on your screen. You can click them. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe it by clicking the logo. Until next time, take care. Bye-bye. Enjoy your spicy cheese pow.